In this video we will understand Unit 8 Stages of Development Here we will study Sigmund Freud's theory Freud psychosexual stages of development and at last Eric Erikson's psychosocial theory Let's start Introduction 1 Human development is a continuous process from conception to death influenced by biological and psychological factors 2 Lifespan development encompasses stages like birth, infancy, adolescence, adulthood, old age, and death. 3. These stages involve learning how to use one's body, express oneself, form relationships, care for others, love, and work. Sigmund Freud's Theory 1. Freud's psychoanalytic theory focuses on unconscious mental processes. 2. He divided the mind into three levels. Conscious, current awareness, preconscious, can become conscious with attention, and unconscious, stores socially unacceptable desires and motivations. 3. Freud proposed a structural model of personality consisting of three elements, id, unconscious, basic instincts, ego, conscious, reality-oriented, and superego, moral conscience. 4. Eros and Thanatos represent life and death instincts within the id. 5. Ego's role is to balance its impulsive desires with reality, leading to decision-making based on logic. 6. Superego is the moral component, internalizing societal values, consisting of conscience and ideal self. 7. Ego employs defense mechanisms to protect against anxiety, such as repression, rationalization, reaction formation, projection, intellectualization, denial, displacement. Freud's Psychosexual Stages of Development 1. Freud proposed five stages of personality development, oral, anal, phallic, latency, and genital. 2. In the oral stage, birth to 18 months, pleasure is derived from the mouth. Overindulgence or underindulgence can lead to oral fixations. 3. The anal stage, 18 months to 3 years, involves control over bowel and bladder movements, with extremes leading to anal fixations. 4. The phallic stage, 3 to 5 years, focuses on genitals as erogenous zones in the Oedipus and Electra complexes. 5. The latency stage, 6 to 12 years, redirects sexual energy into non-sexual activities. 6. The genital stage, 13 years to adulthood, marks the return of sexual energy. And the resolution of previous stages influences adult relationships. Eric Erikson's Psychosocial Theory 1. Erikson's theory is psychosocial, based on the epigenetic principle, emphasizing predetermined stages. 2. He proposed eight stages of development, each with psychosocial tasks, virtues, maladaptations, and malignancies. 3. The stages include trust versus mistrust, autonomy versus shame and doubt, Initiative versus guilt, industry versus inferiority, identity versus role confusion, intimacy versus isolation, generativity versus stagnation, and ego integrity versus despair. 4. The stages progress in a predetermined order, and successful completion of each contributes to the development of psychosocial virtues. 5. Failure to resolve these stages may lead to maladaptive tendencies and malignancies in personality. So here we studied Sigmund Freud's theory, Freud's psychosexual stages of development and at last Eric Erikson's psychosocial theory.